Mbop and an orchestra. That is a scenario I never thought I would combine, but that's what's happening in Toronto and across North America. Some lucky Toronto musicians have been chosen to play a string of concerts with the group Hanson. I have to say, you guys to me are a little bit crazy because my understanding is you just flew into Toronto and you're performing with an orchestra that you haven't performed with yet. Right, I, right, right. Wait. You haven't even met them. Yes. Yeah, no, it's, it's a crazy what? process. <laughs> Every day on this tour, uh, it's a symphony tour. Uh, there's a new symphony in each town and you go on stage and you play for the first time at rehearsal and then the show's that night. <laughs> Six lucky local musicians were given the opportunity to learn the new versions of the group's songs and join them on back-to-back -back nights of a packed house. Every place you play, you're playing with local musicians and you're supporting, you know, great players from this community, keeping them, like, sharing their skills with a, a different audience, maybe. The amount of people that, uh, you know, have said things like, oh, well, I, you know, started playing music, you know, when I was a kid and and you guys' record was one of my favorite first, you know, records or whatever. And now here I am on stage playing violin with you. Like you know, it's it's and it, there's a lot of that that's there's going on. A lot on of shared journey. Yeah, exactly. And it's 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 been really really cool. The show they promise is not like anyone you've seen before. It's almost like a, a musical. Almost like a without almost. the dancing. Okay. Less costume musical. changes? Uh, no, no costume God. changes. No? no costume changes. No sparkles. No dancing. What? Um, but uh, besides that, it really does have that kind of. Just the art. dancing of your soul. Just, yeah. That soul is, dancing. That soul is dancing. soul dancing. This Hanson's is all kind new of musical, <laughs> soul dancing. Oh, yes. it's, this is a bad idea. It's bad. Still ahead on City News, the moment that happened 20 years ago in Toronto that's left an impact on the group's heart and ears. Some lucky Toronto musicians have been chosen to play with the pop band Hanson in a string of shows here in Toronto. But did you know that Hanson actually held a record that's near to their heart right here in the city? Something happened 20 years ago that I read was a record that yes. happened in Toronto. Which yes. Is, how are your ears? Um, slightly deaf, yes. Yeah. I think uh, about 20 years ago, uh, we played a show here at Canada's Wonderland. Was that mm -hmm. what it was? Yeah. And it was the, at the time, it was the loudest concert ever recorded. So I don't know if it still is, but it was very loud. 140 I, decibels. Of I screaming. would say it was so loud you could physically feel when the fans would scream. It sort of comes in waves, and you would you'd be like, Phew, and you'd kind of go like that, like wow. I mean, we didn't hear anything. We yeah. played that show, and uh, neither did we, they. We definitely <laughs> lost some hearing that day. So Toronto has a safe place in your heart yes. and your ears. What? The group has been nominated for multiple Grammy awards and has sold out shows for decades. Yes, decades. The group is celebrating 26 years, a milestone that many musicians never make. We're in a strange industry where people are celebrated for being sort of not very good people. <laughs> you know, if you're a drug addict, if you had, you know, 17 relationships and you've got whatever, drug problems, all these other, like any other part of culture, people would be like, I'm not hiring you, you know, I'm not leaving my kids with you. <laughs> but we grew up with work ethic and like, you commit yourself to something and you try and do a good job. Yeah, and so I think it's, you know, we're just, um, we're just put, we put all of our, challenges and struggles and in and, and our perspective into the songs and then like most people just try and handle yourself the way you'd want to be treated you know so it's not really rocket science you know? <laughs> like try you know what a concept Hanson is currently on tour promoting their new album string theory where they perform their songs with different orchestras around the world